everyone, Sidra here. Welcome back to Fire Emblem Three Houses. Let's share a meal with Sylvain and Sethith. Because nobody else that needs. Yeah, you just get it, Professor. This is my favorite. The flavor is nostalgic to me for some reason. Hmm, I'd like some more. Yeah. Like the, that kind of food. So, full menu. I need. I'll do this. Cause I need Mercedes and Ingrid. Leaves us with two free time. This is my absolute favorite. How did you know, Professor? I appreciate any good meal, but nothing beats enjoying my favorite food. I think I'm going to chef. Um, God, Edelgard. Who, who, who? can I make? Alice gain plus one defense. Yeah, I have all the pike. Luck, one speed. I have a bunch of that too. Two decks. I have a bunch of that. Plus one strength. Plus three max HP. I'm going to make the immortality stew. Give everyone plus one defense. Um, cook with that. He, kn he knows what he's doing when it comes to cooking. I love to cook. What are we making today? Is that so? I have a lot of experience in the kitchen. I can make just about anything. Nice. Wow. Plus one defense for the rest of the month. And... I think I might enter the tournament anyway. Just for... Crude arrowheads. Favors the bow. Just for the last free time. Destruction to magic. I'm so sorry. I never quite know what to say at times like these. Just don't push yourself too hard too soon. It's okay to allow yourself to be sad right now. Losing someone dear to you. Well, each loss is unique. But it's a feeling I know very well. That said, Professor, I... Thank you. Oh no. Professor, thank you for all you have done for us. Nothing to report today. <laughs> Poor gatekeeper. A professor, nothing to report. Yeah, very sad. Hey, welcome. You have a good eye. A, you have a, a pleasure doing. You have a good. A, you have a good. A, a you have a good eye. A you have a good. A, a you have a good eye. A pleasure doing. Come again. Hello there. This one, yes. I think this one, yes. I th this one, yes. I thank you. This one, yes. This one, yes. I think this one, yes. I think this one, yes. I this one, yes. I this one, yes. I this one, yes. I thank you. Return soon. Hello there. Return soon, please. Welcome. Okay, let's see. Into the convoy for now. Will this one Another do? silver sword. Many thanks. Will this one do? Another silver Many thanks. Maybe killer weapon. I don't think they turned to anything. 
Uh, well, this one axe. Many things. Will this one do? Silver bow. Many things. Come back do. soon. And that's for after the. What do you uh, require? Farewell. After we get Professor B plus, which will be coming up sometime this month, we'll be getting it. Guaranteed. Ah. <sighs> The other night, I... I had the honor of sharing a drink with Gerald. <laughs> he was pretty tactless, honestly. He could be blunt at times. But he always looked like such a proud, happy father whenever he spoke of you. <laughs> I do believe that's everybody. And although I do not need the the prize, the event seal, uh, the uh, 1,000 gold. Huh, I figured Claude would be last. Or maybe he is. It goes top to bottom, right? Let's see, we use a training bow. Get 1,000 gold. Okay. And an advance seal. That's how it goes. Not double burn Doing my part. Continues. Eight fifteen. Yeah, I'll take three hits again. Darn. Restore HP. Yes. the other HP before um, the fight's called. Oh, good dodge. I must steal myself. Restore the HP. 12. 15. We go first, though, so as long as he doesn't miss... Doing my part. Fancy you and one thousand gold. Get professor level from that, so really happy about that. Alright. That's going to complete that. Um, be with Sylvain. 
Aim with Ash. Oh, no, can't do that yet. Uh, sure. Let's do the let's do the support, and then we'll continue on. Vane, <laughs> what happened? Oh, Professor, <laughs> I didn't realize you were there. If we keep running into each other like this, people will start to talk. They'll say, Sylvain and the Professor are on the prowl. <laughs> ah, forget it. What do you need? Girl problem with Sylvain? I fell for that girl recently, but I just wanted to have some fun and leave it at that. So, I told her we should break it off. I guess she was feeling a little more serious than I was. She started crying, and everything got a bit complicated. <laughs> You're complicated. <laughs> You're complicated. Come on, Professor. Something I would Playing around with girls is the most fun a guy can have. I uh, don't do that. D d don't do that. And lady, the other, the other, the other way too. Ladies, don't just like play around, toy with guys. Don't do that. Besides, I don't care what you think of me. I don't intend to change how I live my life. Maybe you I'm should. I'm a good for nothing, if you haven't noticed. But I'm still a noble with a crest. That's all anyone cares about. It's best to avoid getting too serious with fools like that. It only leads to trouble. <laughs> I'm gonna be forced into an arranged marriage with some random noble woman anyway. By the way, Professor, you didn't know you had a crest, did you? Never thought much about it. I see. I suppose a mercenary wouldn't be concerned with such things. What was your experience? Most children who are born to noble families are tested upon birth to see if they bear one. Even descendants of the ten elites, like myself, can't be legitimate heirs without a crest. That means as children, we're only accepted if we're born with one. The heads of most noble houses keep having kids until they get one with a crest. Those children then grow up to be heads of their houses, and the vicious cycle continues. That's really crazy. Do you really get sad. it now? To all these commoner girls, I'm just a trophy, or rather, a stud horse. That's pretty cynical, but you mean they only want you for your bloodline? I mean, I could see, see? that. I knew you'd get it. These girls don't love me. They love the potential rewards of loving me. If I marry a girl and she gives birth to a child with a crest, that kid might become the next head of House Gautier. But nowadays, with the bloodlines getting weaker, there are a lot of kids like my brother, born with no hope. For ages now, those of us with crests have been envied and desired, but never for who we are. I understand the value of my blood. Believe me, I hate how much I understand it. I know better than to dream of being free from this burden. I'm used to it by now. I used to think I didn't have the right to live freely. You don't think that way anymore? <laughs> That's right. You know what? I'm a bit jealous. The whole time you were growing up, you never knew you had a crest. You were free. Nobody pretended to like you. I kind of hate you for that. You were a spoiled brat who should pay for that crest. Maybe I'll collect the debt. <laughs> gotcha! Wow, you should have seen the look on your face just then. Don't mind me, Professor. After all, ladies love a dark and brooding noble. Uh, I don't know about the whole hot gotcha part. Like, that was That was pretty serious. I could. Could. <coughs> Sorry. Uh, let's see the end of the Dimitri. Uh, Your Highness, Savannah. why are you in my room? <laughs> Sorry, I need to hide in here just for a while. I'll have you know this is all your fault. Uh oh. Hide from who? It's some um, a girl from the academy. I'm sorry. It's a what? 
<laughs> I'm sorry, what? This is all because of your insistence that I go and ask a girl out. You didn't give her a dagger, did you? Is that why you're hiding? Does she have a dagger, Dimitri? <laughs> Maybe. Look, you kept true to your promise to improve your behavior. So I felt it was only right to make good on my side of the bargain, too. Uh oh. Oh, man. You invited a girl to dinner, and now she's chasing you around. What's the big deal? Unless. Did you use one of my pickup lines? Those words are dangerous in the wrong hands. <laughs> Those words are dangerous With in the wrong me, hands. People know a line's a line, and I'm joking. But you, nobody's ever accused you of being funny. True. I clearly underestimated the difficulty of the task. But what do I do now? <laughs> I, I, <laughs> I, I calculated the risk, but man, I'm bad at math. That's what Dimitri just did. <laughs> Relax, your highness. Relax. I'll sort this whole thing out real easy. All we have to do is figure out how to make this girl lose interest in you. And making girls lose interest is what I'm best at. <laughs> you just wait right there, and I'll fix everything. Uh, it was okay. my naivete that brought this about. I cannot place this immense burden on your shoulders. This is no job for an amateur. You need a professional's help. Sylvain is the professional here. Trying to do everything yourself has never served you so well. So just leave this to the master. Even the dagger incident could have been avoided if you had just talked with me beforehand. There wasn't time for consultation. I only learned she was leaving on the day of her departure. Whatever you say. The point is, you need to learn to rely on me for these types of things in the future. For now, I got this. And if I ever need help with... something you know how to help with, then maybe you can do the same for me. Sylvain. Very well. When that time comes, I promise to help you as best I can. A knight of Fargus never goes back on his word. Isn't that right? You're a good man, Sylvain. I'm sorry to do this to you. Best of luck. Please, your highness. I've spent years honing my skills for just this situation. Watch and learn. I've spent years honing my skills for just this situation. Oh, see, you can't, you can't end it there. Like that's, I need to know. Like, <laughs> game. <laughs> I need to see that conversation. I need to know how that plays out. And, and there's nothing. And it's sad. Alright. Struck manually. Alright. Oh, I didn't... I didn't catch to do some... Some other time. I can work on that. Um, I wonder what I need to. What do I need swords for? I don't remember. This will be useful. Work on authority. This will be useful. All due to your coaching. Thanks. I'm a bit embarrassed. This will be useful. Okay. Let's go. Says. Now I have a reason to work on that, but I'm curious. Yes, very good. Yes, very good. Thank you, Professor. I couldn't have done it without you. Try to get it to... <laughs> I'm sure I'll get it again next time. Whatever's next, probably S. Thank you, Professor. I couldn't have done it without you. Now I feel like I'm getting somewhere. Sword. Looks like I did it. Ah, no big deal. That was challenging. I appreciate your guidance. 
Sword is now a D. I think it needs to be C. It all makes sense now. She has the A in lance and the A in flying. more. Um, try to get this to see. Oh, that's a relief. <laughs> You're making me blush. This will be useful. This will be useful. Alright, at least that's at C now. Am I starting kind to master this? Now let's continue to work on both. I've learned a lot. I've learned a lot. All right, one more. Um, flame. All thanks to your help. I would like to do this again sometime. All right, that's that. Begin lecture. Professor, may I ask you a question? I want to be able to talk to males and make friends with them, but my brother always causes such a fuss when I do. Have any advice for me? <laughs> do when he's not looking. You, you should have an honest talk with your brother. Ah, I see. 420. Darn. Sure, I was hoping that would... The XP from that would be enough. I will enjoy this. Let's give it our all. So not this week, but next week we Here's will. Here's the result. We'll be able to get it. Uh, good. Five hundred gold. Three smithing stones. Today, be a him, sure. It's hard to sneak out when the professor is watching. <laughs> Regardless of the quality, this is a good chance for us to prove our solidarity. Got a story. Oh, there's an extra one hundred. For his birthday. Five flowers. Can't even do tea. Doesn't have time for tea. Okay, we're gonna battle because the rare monster sighting, so we're definitely gonna do that. Um, I think everybody is. I have advanced seals now. I guess I can. A warlock. Oh wow, it doesn't have a reason. Whoa. Looks way different. So let's save and See if we get it or not. Oh, got it. If you see the notes, that means they passed. If you see, like, the um, bundle of purple and black lines of course i passed i am a scholar <laughs> i am a scholar 
four extra defense, two extra speed. Um, if you see the purple and then the black mess of lines, um, it means they failed. So you know even before it pops up. Yes. Yeah, okay. I said I think that's... I think that's it. Okay. I already did shopping. I got a little bit of time with this episode. Let's go ahead and start up the battle. And I guess with the other free time, we'll do the cream of the crop. Money. Route the bandits in Fulton's throat. So level 24. Okay. Battle at the border. Alright, let's take a look what we got. Oh good, Catherine and Samir could still be here. Neat. Bullion, so money. You actually don't drop anything. You, you're using a silver lance. Huh. You can almost hurt uh, Dimitri. Isn't that crazy? Alright, there's the rare monster. A rusted lance that turns into... Gradvius. Again, probably need A plus professor level for that, but it'll be cool once we can make it. Alright, so we'll definitely have to do that. I guess start sitting the um, start sitting to do that way. next time we'll do this fight it shouldn't take too long I don't think no the enemies are higher level I should be a bit more careful um, with some luck we'll get through both battles though and we can move on with the rest of the week it's gonna be a lot of it should go fairly quickly unless like supports pop up because it's just gonna be um, like until we get to the the battle it'll be spending free free time on Getting professor level, just like eating with the students, or uh, spending the free time and upping my stats. So it should go fairly quickly, and so the instruction should go fairly quickly too, because I'll start speeding through the uh, through the dialogue since we've heard it a lot now. Uh, that's the plan. So thanks for watching. To the next episode, I'm Central. Remember to shoot for the stars and take care, everyone.